Hey guys, welcome back to part two of the mason jar, the frosted mason jar tutorial. I did take the mason jar out of the air fryer. I took it out and set it over there in front of my high speed fan. I like to pull my stuff off before I play with it. Um, it's been sitting over there for about six minutes. Um, leave it over there for around six minutes to cool off um, because glass cools down slower than the tumbler. So it takes a little bit longer because the material is thicker. So I am going to run over there now and grab it out um, from in front of the fan so we can see what it looks like. So here it is. Also with anything frosted or like your um, color changing mugs, when you try to, when I try to um, take the paper off while they're still hot, you run the risk of scratching the outer coating, um, especially on those color changing mugs. So I always, especially when they're hot, they're a little more sensitive um, and you can damage it easier. So I like to um, let everything cool off first to give lessen my chances of it um, scratching the surface. As you can see in the background, I've got my little setup going for my toppers that I'm going to be making. Um, I have a couple of strawberry lemonade toppers I'm getting ready to work on. And I'm just going to actually make a lemon one for this one. So that is what it is looking like right now. And it came out. This It came out pretty good, you guys. I need to get some better lighting out here. My workshop is out in my garage and I need um, some better lighting, but that's what it looks like, guys. And let me put my top on there. And I'm actually going to be making a removable um, ice topper for this one. All right. Thanks for watching.